Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Chrissy Arian. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Chrissy Arian. Don't, don't forget to subscribe down below and click the notification bell so you will be notified every time I post a video. I post a video two times a week. I post a video on Wednesday, which is my usual makeup videos, and I post a video on Sunday, which are my weekly vlogs and vlogs of the week. So, for so without further ado, let's get started. We're going to do a first impression on this is not a new product, but I was looking at eyebrow product products that were really, really um, affordable. So Watsons, and I found something interesting, and I used to use Ever Banana eyebrow products, but alam niyo yung creamy siya, but it's too creamy na hindi ko siya magamit. So, yun yung mga eyebrow products nila. And I saw this for the first time in my Watsons. And this is the Precision Blender from Ever Palana. This retails for 85 pesos. And alam nyo guys, sobrang first impressions to kasi wala silang tester. So, I I looked for a mga may tester. Ayan. Tapos, pinag-compare ko yung parang cap. Kung bagay ba. So, yun. And I try it for the first time. Sana guys, maganda. So tatang I have my eyebrows right now. So tatanggal ko lang sila. So wait. Guys, natanggal ko na yung eyebrow makeup ko. Wala akong makeup aside from my eyebrows kasi nga I have this ano parang putol yung eyebrows ko dito when I was trimming it with my blade. I accidentally trimmed. Sobra ko na trim and may hiwa ako diyan ngayon kaya hindi ko muna siya ginagalaw kasi masakit. So, ito. So, guys. Ito nga. If you're talking about packaging, ito yung packaging niya. Ito lang talaga. Walang box. Walang anything. Ayan lang yung sticker ng Presho Watsons. So, ito yung name. Wait. So, yan. We are going to see this for the first time kasi nga walang tester. So, let's open it. Tanggalin ko muna yung price. Hindi. Ano na lang. Sabay na lang kasi pag-open. At parang may babaeng gustong buksan ito ng una kasi parang may dent na siya. So guys, ito na siya. Five minutes later, natanggal ko na siya. So guys, ito lang siya. Ang hirap niyang tanggalin, nagka-dent na yung pinaka-pencil. Pinaka and it looks so good. Parang ang ganda niyang tingnan kasi it's gold. So wala siyang ibang nakasulat kundi stock number blah blah blah. This is 12.5 centimeters. And yung name niya, the first Precision Blender. So, it comes with a brush. Dapat, ang bibilin ko yung Sassy Cosmetics na um, Precise Eyebrow Pencil. Kaso, wala siyang brush and wala akong brush for my pencil. I do, ano, nakadepende lang ako sa mga gantong product na may brush para sa mga brush ko. And most of the time, matat nawawala ako sila. But this, guys, the, nasa kabilang end yung brush. So, this is the cap. This is the pencil. I haven't swatched this yet, guys. But, oh my god, look at this. Tapos, this is the pencil, the brush. So, it's good. So, let's do a swatch. Oh my gosh. That glided on so easily. But guys, yun nga, diba? Sinasabi ko sa inyo, ever been in a product, lalo na yung brow pencil nila, sobrang creamy na hindi ko sila nagugustuhan. So, let's see kung creamy ito masyado for my liking. Um, I'm just gonna do my eyebrows. Guys, 
guys, alam niyo ba kung bakit ayaw ko na cream products? Kasi sobrang bilis niya mawala. And... And this is the other eyebrow and guys so this is one eyebrow guys and I'm having mixed feelings about the color actually kasi kung nakita nyo yung eyesh eyebrow ko bago yung video na to it's grayish hindi siya brown and guys I have a reason bakit grayish ang ginagamit ko I have this thing in my eyebrow na kailangan araw-araw ng kilay and kung hindi siya, kung ganda siya ka dark, hindi siya mukha natural. So I don't think I would be using this at school. So let's try the other eyebrow. Really makes feelings about this eyebrow pencil. I think I should have got a shade lighter, but I remembered they only have two shades. Guys, I don't put it looks black. I know baggy, baggy is a hair color, but for my skin preference, my color preference, I don't like black I, I, eyebrows. Plus, I can't wear this to school because. I go to school with eyebrows because of that yung shave ko nga. Let's try it. I'm gonna swatch it in my hand. Just let's try it with the powder of Maybelline. Guys, if you're asking, if you're going to ask for update, because I did first impression on this uh, Maybelline New York, that is because naputol ko ka agad yung pencil. As in, super minimal na yung ko for my eyebrows and naputol ko siya. Oh, I can like make it lighter with this. But for the sake of the video, I'm not gonna put any powder on this eyeliner. So yun. Um, first impression, creamy. Sobrang creamy. Um, so, di, I'm not gonna say sobrang blendable. Kasi, I did have a hard time blending it. And up to now, parang gusto ko siyang i-blend, i-blend para mag lighter. But it gave me great eyebrows, guys. Para mukha talaga siyang defined eyebrows. But of course, if you're going to use it for school, you wouldn't like defined eyebrows for school. Lalo nung araw-araw, diba? But I don't have any issues with this. Except for one thing. This is such a creamy product. Na hindi ko nagustuhan yung pagka-creamy niya, guys. Para isang... When you look... At it, I swatch it like that. Yan palang, galan palang swatch na siya. Na parang na dent ko kaagad yung product and masyado siyang creamy. Guys, kasi pag masyadong creamy ang isang pencil, tendency is you're gonna sharpen it a lot. As in a lot. Bakit? Kasi, ayan, sa application palang pudpud na siya. Sharpen it and ang tendency kung araw-araw mo siyang gagamitin, ubus to guys in one week. But I don't think you will in one week if you don't use So, for first impressions, like it. Mixed feelings about the color. Um, creamy, sobrang creamy. So, packaging-wise, it's hard to buy. I hope they ano na lang, had a sticker on this. Part, tapos it's printed on the pencil. Most of the ingredients, the price, yon. But within the brush, really like the brush kasi kung mara, maliit na lang siya. I can use this and this wooden um, dito mawawala guys. Kasi, ito na lang siya sa dulo. I like it. 
Tapos, yun. What else can I say? Um, creamy, sobrang creamy. Packaging mo. Okay, let's, guys. Sorry for I'm not on. Sabi mo videos ko na. First impressions, reviews. Karan tayo. So, guys, since since this is the first impression, parang gusto ko nilang ayusin yung mga first impressions ko. So, ang gagawin natin, um, packaging, longevity, um, smoothness, price, quality, yung parang ganun. So, packaging... Eight of ten, seven out of ten, because it's so hard for me. It's hard for me to open it. Um, pigmentation, pigmentation, guys, ten out of ten. This is super pigmented. And do you want, guys? Do you want something like that? Like, guys, let me know in the comments down below if you want me to have like a zoom in video or para zoom in to my products that I use. If it's chalky, it's not. Patchy. It's not patchy. So, yun. Packaging, 7 out of 10. Pigmentation, 10 out of 10. Color, meh, 5 over 10. Longevity, di pa natin. But we will, we will test that today. It is currently for something. Basta 4 na na hapon. So, yun. I'm gonna film another video. Tapos, magsishakin ako sa inyo guys. Later, baka later the night, later the evening, ganon. So, yun. Um, as of now, as of now, ha, I like it. I really like it. Not for everyday look, I guess, pero I really like it. So, yun. See you guys in later. Sa check-in ko. Sa Robinson Snack ko. And, um, no. Sa Robinson Snack ko. Kasi pa, nasa school naman ako gati. Sura ko, nakasalamin ako. Kaya, hindi uh, makalata. Pero, um, yun lang. Parang gusto ko lang talaga behind. Behind. May glasses. May maganda akong kita. So, and it's all second day na tinry ko yung eyebrow product na finished impressions ko. This would be in my vlog. Or baka ipasok ko to dun sa video na first impressions. Check in, something. Pero, ito na yung eyebrows ko right now. I don't know. Yeah, they're, they're kind of like a Johnny Chopin. Well, I Ross are sisters, not twins. So, yun. And guys, I really, really, really don't like the product. Pigmentation, okay, good. Um, creaminess, good. It, that it's creamy. But guys, that was the problem. It was too creamy for my liking. Hindi na lang for my liking eh. I was sharpening the pencil this morning and it crumbled up as in wait. The, I sharpened this this morning. And guys, can you para kita niyo na ba kung gaano karaming nabawas ko? Kaka-sharpen. I sharpened this three times. Three times na. And yun, sabi ko, it crumbled up guys as in alam niyo yung ano Hindi, alam niyo yung parang bagong tas ang pencil, di ba? Mati matulis yun. <coughs> I was looking forward to that. And ito yung nangyari. As in, eh, no, 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 no. Wouldn't purchasing this again. I, ano, I prefer pa yung perfect eyebrows pencil nila. Kasi creamy yun, but this is creamier. And, oh God, no, please, no. I wouldn't suggest this product, guys, because it's creamy, it's pigmented, but guys, you can't sharpen this thing, and I am using, guys, I am an art student, I am an illustration student, so I have pencils na talagang maarte, as in yung, ano niya, yung sharpener niya is really for delicate products, and guys, ang ginagamit kong um, sharpener is yung, Favorite ko sharpener na kahit yung 7 ko, 6 ko, mabilis na sharpen, which is the soft soft pencils pa ha. Um, ginagamit ko yung sa from, ano yung brand yun? Faber-Castell. And guys, mas sobrang talim na nun, kaya yung mga gilid, dapat may sharpen siya. And, no, it didn't sharpen it. And I've used that in so many products that are pencils, in my eyeliners, in my um, eyebrow 
until that I have used that product used and abused yung product na yun and this is the first time na nagamit ko yun nagrambe yung crumble ng pencil so guys I wouldn't be recommending guys this to you kung lalo na kung kayo you have thick eyebrows like me na may sparse areas na gusto talagang takpan kasi matatakpan niya guys pero it, mabilis kayo maubos sa product yun lamang sabi ko mabilis kayo maubos pero yun nga habol ko lang dyan yung brush so yun this is an update guys siguro nila mag update after this